alkaline metals are soft silvery metals found in group one of the periodic table. They have low melting points and boiling points when compared with other metals in groups two and three. They are solids at room temperature, but at temperatures slightly above room temperature, francium, cesium, and rubidium can exist as liquids. Alkaline metals are univalent. This means they have one valence electron, or they have one electron on their large shells. Lithium is 2,1. Sodium is 2,8,1. Potassium is 2,8,8,1. Rubidium is 2,8,18,8,1. Cesium is 2,8,18,18,8,1. And francium is 2,8,18,32,18,8,1. Alkaline metals are electropositive and good reducing agents. They easily lose electrons. This makes them very good reducing agents. Lithium loses an electron to form lithium ion. Sodium can also lose an electron. This forms sodium ion. The ease with which alkali metals lose electrons makes them electropositive and very good reducing agents. Alkali metals donate electrons. This forms ionic compounds, e.g. in the formation of sodium chloride. Sodium with one electron on its valence or last shell donates that electron to chlorine, which has seven electrons. This donation makes sodium become positive and chlorine negative. The formation of sodium chloride shows uh, how sodium donates an electron to chlorine to form the ionic compound sodium chloride. They react vigorously with cold water to liberate hydrogen gas. Sodium combines with cold water. This forms sodium hydroxide and hydrogen gas. They react vigorously with cold water to liberate hydrogen gas but also they form alkalis. Potassium combines with cold water. It forms the alkali and liberating hydrogen gas. So alkali metals are metals that dissolve in water to form alkalis. Sodium combines with water to form an alkali, sodium hydroxide. Potassium dissolves in water to form alkali, potassium hydroxide. Alkalis are soluble bases. The oxides of alkali metals also dissolve in water to form very strong alkalis, e.g., sodium oxide dissolves in water to form sodium hydroxide. Sodium oxide dissolves in water to form sodium hydroxide. Rubidium oxide also dissolves in water to form rubidium hydroxide. Rubidium oxide also dissolves in water, forms rubidium hydroxide. These are very strong alkalis. They are trioxonitrate five salts decomposed with difficulty to form dioxonitrate three salts, e.g. sodium nitrate. When heated, it forms sodium nitrite, and oxygen gas. Also, potassium nitrate, when decomposed, forms potassium nitrite and oxygen gas. This is because of the reactivity of alkali metals.